hey guys welcome back to another vlog so i basically just started packing right now the time is um one o'clock in the night um and i just started packing because my dad is coming to pick me up tomorrow and i need to leave tomorrow so i thought why not vlog it for you guys and show you the whole process i was gonna film like like a moving out vlog but honestly i've left it too late it's one o'clock now and like i'm not the type of person to like organize everything but look at my room right now like it's so messy <laughs> it's so messy it's literally so messy so i'm just gonna show everything into a suitcase because I have a lot of stuff to pack. This is what my wardrobe looks like. I don't think my uh, wardrobe is too bad, actually. I think I've kept it quite well. Also, actually, let me turn this fan off. This is something I would really recommend if you guys, are, if any of you are moving, uni or wherever it is, or even if you need, like, really good storage. These vacuum bags, I literally, I think I got them for £10 from... 10 or 20 something like that or maybe 30 i don't remember from literally from amazon and it came in a pack of six so these are like some of the big ones and then i have a few small ones in there and i literally just used that for all my packing because it fit all my clothes if I hadn't done that then none of my stuff was fitting in the car it was just too much stuff and um wait i just spilled coke all over my bed annoying because I'm, it's gonna be so disgusting but at least i don't have to wash it i can wash it when i get home and i'm gonna use this suitcase this one to put all my important stuff that i kind of need straight away when i'm home like a pack of pajamas i'm saying a pack i mean like <laughs> a pair of pajamas and like you know just stuff i need on that day and the day after because i'm not gonna unpack everything when i go back it's so annoying i think what i'm gonna do is put everything in a suitcase and just bring that suitcase back to uni next year <laughs> bags i literally had like the perfect spot here in my uni room to put all my bags because i literally love my handbags and stuff most of them are already at home because i went back back a couple of days ago so i just thought why not take some of my stuff back but i've only taken like a couple of bags and a couple of stuff so basically these i'm just gonna put oh you can tell i haven't used it in a long time uh there's so much dust in it but i'm just gonna put all my handbags in this place this black one this is the one i travel with when i go back and these are gonna i'm literally not even gonna organize them i'm just gonna put them like that because there's no point like it's two o'clock and like not be bothered and this is my clothes but i still got more though i got a lot more oh that's so long unpacking and packing is literally like my worst thing i hate doing it i literally hate doing it because it's just so long but i gotta do it my dad is gonna be here i think at um nine o'clock in the morning so i still need to pack my kitchen stuff i haven't even done that my kitchen is so disgusting right now also these this is all my low vista jewelry that i have i'm just gonna put that in here as well because i'm not bothered just want it out so yeah that's just gonna be like that yeah actually kind of decorated and these i got whoa i got these on my birthday just thought they went well with the vogue that's why i put them there but i don't really know if i am gonna actually use them so i don't really know if i want to keep it or not but i'm gonna put all the vogues and stuff in here as well 
because it's just in one i don't need to open this in summer room looks like such a mess i'm gonna miss these walls so much, uh this collage i think i might keep the prints actually because um because i really like my wall art i think it looks very nice cute there were fairy lights up there going along the top but i removed them because i had a party in my flat yesterday so yeah had to take those there and then and then this over here and then i have my leds these are actually from home they were behind my tv but i took them out and then i need to get rid of these i think i might just put everything shove it all in this suitcase i have no time for it so i am just going to dump it all in one makeup bag and leave it there okay maybe not this because it will spill but i'm just going to put everything in one makeup bag um also i just ordered pizza and they forgot my pepperoni so that's gonna be a bit disgusting to have but yeah this one i'm doing with my makeup i'm just gonna put it in one bag because i don't have time to like separate everything so all of this all of this and two of these go in there whoa hey guys good morning I just woken up it's 8 30 and i just had a coffee and i was packing my kitchen because i basically need to leave my room soon and like i haven't even finished packing but like i just don't know like there's so much stuff i didn't i underestimated how long it was going to take me to do this because i've kind of done my wardrobe there's like little stuff that i don't know where it goes i've kind of done my table um this is all the this is all the clothes, but I'm so annoyed because basically these vacuum bags, I think they have a hole in them or like I might have ripped them whilst I was moving them because I took the <clears throat> air out last night and when I woke up, they're all like blown up again. So that's really annoying. But yeah, I'm going to get rid of all of this and the bed stuff before my dad gets here because I don't have time. Now I'm about to take all of this down all of these this lovely piece of art that i had uh this is gonna take me really long because there's like so many like little like pieces put together but oh my god this is literally one of the f like first few night outs it's me Maisie, hannah and chloe that we went on and then this one of me this is literally my favorite um favorite ever i love this um me and emily so yeah, i'm gonna put these away so i can stick them when i go back home my mom is gonna really want these actually so yeah i'm gonna keep them for her but i'm gonna get rid of this i'm so sad <laughs> my hair up and just put on a vest top because i'm gonna go to reception and try and get a trolley so i don't want to look like a tramp um and i think me and my dad might go out for a bit once we've like moved all my stuff into the car but i'm literally sweating and also i really don't think we're gonna be able to take my duvets and stuff back i might have to buy another one for next year because I really doubt there's gonna be enough space because those vacuum bags are not closing and then this is all my shit. Um, these are all my shoes, all of them. I'm so glad I kept the boxes, you know, because I feel like it would have been so hard. These are the shoes, um, these ones, these shoes I don't have like boxes for because they're like, you know, boots and stuff. So I put them in that bag. But yeah, I'm glad I kept them boxes. And then this is all my, <laughs> This is all clothes slash bed stuff, like my lamp that went above my bed. And yeah, rest of it is clothes, jackets, things like that. I just 
just got rid of everything. My room looks so different. I feel like all my room's personality is gone. Also, it kind of made me realize how much stuff I actually had on my walls because I'm still not even done taking these off. These, this stuff, I need to take it off because uh, I can use it in my room next year, maybe. Um, I've not kept all the prints. I've pretty much thrown them all away because I don't want to take shit back. But, um, yeah, I'm all done packing. So sad. Look at my kitchen. <laughs> it is, uh, this is all, these are all my dishes. I haven't washed them because this is so disgusting. If I even step a foot near it, like there's so many flies that just come out. I don't even want to show you that, but this is all the food that I'm like, just leave. this is like mine and flatmate stuff. I'm not really taking anything back home. This was my cupboard if anyone was interested. I'm not gonna take any of the food home. So I've just like emptied everything. And yeah, this is all my mine and my flatmate stuff. I put all my spices in here that my mom gave me, um, which I never used. This is what the fridge is disgusting. Our fridge is so disgusting. But yeah, I think I'm gonna take my fairy lights actually. But apart from that, this is our lovely kitchen. I really am dreading washing my dishes because it's like so like disgusting in here. It's so the thing is everyone in this flat is moving out on the 16th which is today which is a saturday so they haven't cleaned the kitchen like the cleaners don't come like one week before you're going so yeah the kitchen hasn't been cleaned for two weeks like a week and a half two weeks right so the bins are all here plus everyone's moving out so all of their rubbish is in the kitchen all of our dishes are there i'm so tempted to just leave the dishes here but that's a waste, isn't it? But look at that. How am I supposed to? Gently just dropped this glass, and it's my favorite glass ever. So that's kind of annoying. But I'm done packing. I'm literally, I, I swear to God, I don't think I'd wash my dishes in the whole of first year. Because I felt like I was washing dishes for so long. I'm going to leave like some of the, I'm going to leave the cups and the spoons and the stuff here. Because I'll just get some new ones for next year. But I'm done. This glass broke though, because I'm not going to have another glass. Because I bought two matching ones, but whatever is all my stuff i'm quite shocked actually at the amount of stuff i had to be fair i don't really cook a lot so yeah this is all i got and this is my extension extension cord and like random like i have like a baking tray and stuff in here <laughs> I'm sorry, but my mom is just so cute. She's so thoughtful. I really wanted my mom to come and pick me up, but she couldn't because she's at work. But that is so sweet. <laughs> my mom's like me donuts, as if I can buy. It. I can't buy it from here, but my dad. I'm giving this up to my dad, and he's putting it away. Now I just need to take this fan, which is the biggest thing. I feel like it's so bulky because I threw the box away, and then I need to take the extension cord, and then I'm done. And then I need to take my fairy lights. I've literally just finished moving everything out. Oh my god, I can even hear my echo. I literally have dust all over me. I'm so disgusting, but this is so sad. I've literally moved every, everything out. Because my flat is all officially empty. Oh my god, this feels so weird. It's literally 
all out there's nothing left there's just like bits and bobs that i don't really need and then in here i've left all my bed sheets towels uh bed covers all of the bed stuff i've i've just left it because i don't want to take that home i'm gonna buy that new for next year so whoa that is loud in the toilet it's all empty oh my god i'm gonna miss this so much this stuff i'm just gonna leave because these products they're almost like gone anyways so yeah it's all empty this feels so weird i'm gonna miss this mirror so much because i used to take my ootds here <laughs> lol but yeah i just need to take this fairy light off and then i'm done first year has been amazing i can't believe i'm gonna be staying here for the last time i mean i haven't really figured out where i'm gonna figured out where i'm gonna stay next year i'm so out of breath because i've literally been going up and down up and down but yeah i don't know where i'm gonna stay next year i'm gonna figure that out i've left it so late but i've had so many other things going on but yeah I said but like 50 times. I'm literally so exhausted. But yeah, end of first year. How was everyone else's first year? If you were in your first year, let me know. Hope it went well for you. Mine was amazing. Hi. Okay, bye. I just washed my face. I'm just going to put a little bit of um just this aloe vera gel on my face because we are now in wagamama's i love how you can see my dad bolted we came to wagamama's for some food i gave my key in signed my contract did all the paperwork that i needed to do now I'm waiting for some food i ordered a vegetarian yeah so we ordered well i ordered a vegetarian katsu curry for my dad because he's a vegetarian um and i just ordered down my cauliflower because i'm not really fancy eating anything uh i really want to go to starbucks which is right opposite and get a really nice cold drink i don't want food so i just ordered down my cauliflower yeah I'm gonna take my dad around Brighton, go to the beach, and then we're gonna head home. I'm actually trying the Bama for the first time, so I'm gonna do my taste test. They didn't give me a fork. That's really good. We got some Starbucks. Wait. It's the espresso chocolate. Um, something espresso. Because I need an espresso. And then I got this. Let's swap it. I got this. Which is the pink. Pink one. I don't really like this. I'm trying this for the first time as well. I don't mind. This is better. <laughs> I don't think he likes coffee. Every time we go out and I order something, he just says it's too bitter. Look at the car. We just sat in the car literally just now. Because there's... Yeah, just park here. Basically, we've been looking for um, parking because there's no parking in Brighton anywhere. Because it's a really sunny day, so everything is really full. We just found parking now. So my dad's gonna park the car and then we can go to the beach for a bit and chill. Favorite flower shop. I just wanted to show it to my dad if anyone wants to buy flowers in Brighton. Guys, I think I'm gonna get one of these because my grandparents are here from India, so I'm gonna get them one. Thanks.
just got some ice cream. My dad's paying for everything today, so I'm going to abuse it <laughs> because that's my favorite. I also got chocolate, but my dad's having that one. Do you like it? But yeah. Hello. <laughs> oh, look, it's doing a little stretch. That is so too hot for me and my dad so we're going back to the car park i just got a bottle of water my dad is already burnt i don't know how we literally sat at the beach for like 20 minutes but yeah we're gonna go back now i was gonna take him to the marina but he's just too hot he wants to go back and so do i so we're boring like that hey guys so we have now left Brighton and we are on our way back home it's I think oh it's 5 13 we were sitting at the beach it's it was so busy I filmed a few clips so you guys can see how busy it was it was literally so busy and the thing is we wanted to stay there for longer but it was just so hot like it was actually boiling we had some ice cream to cool down and stuff but it was just too hot like i i felt like i just needed to leave so yeah we just left and then we i took my dad on like a brighton tour just showed him everything around my campus my where i go on the daily i'm gonna stop recording but i bought a magnet we now have about one hour left or something like that one hour 20 minutes um and i'm just going to i'm just just editing my vlog from wimbledon so then i can upload it either tonight or tomorrow because when i go home i have a lot of work to do so yeah i'm gonna edit that and yeah that's all really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog my moving vlog did really 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 well my views were actually like amazing on that and i don't really get that many views on my videos so i really wanted to make a moving out vlog and also i i just thought it'd be really useful for someone who wants to move into brighton and you know yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed my vlog there is literally so much traffic mm. like so much traffic because there's some accident happening and yeah. Oh yeah. Yay! The other star. I'm so glad it all fit, you know, because I really thought it wasn't gonna fit. But my dad put everything in there, so yeah.